Report to you live here from Improved Canada for the Way Back, a journey through the 90s festival. It's live from last week. Let's go! my fellow jaywalkers to another episode of live from last week hope last week has served you well just a quick shameless plug before we go on I want you guys to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel so recalling what i said just yesterday in last week's episode staying up all day before i go in for my first of two night shifts tonight and a busy lack of sleep next couple of days if you ask me well today i've got news for you after getting off yet another busy night shift this morning in between my two night shifts with me going back to work later on i had quickly stopped by the condo to eat before heading to our local car rental place at hertz to reunite with something that we have met and seen in the past this red tesla for the day and so getting myself ready to nap a little bit in between my night shifts and be a passenger princess to the wife we made our way to trek all the way to the saint catherine's area to the beautiful location of the sorella farms for the wife to do a quick venue tour of this place. Whoa, look at all the people. Look at all the people. But it's only one person. <laughs> of where she will coordinate a wedding in the near future. We next thought of a spontaneous idea while we were in the area to make a quick pit stop at the sights and scenes as well as all the attractions, driving down the famous area of Clifton Hill, and quickly visiting the one, the only, Niagara Falls. Then afterwards, in rush hour traffic, driving back to the Saga area. Then you can play the Mario Kart uh, music. Dun, 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 to drop by a local car dealership checking out several of their pretty nice cars here mainly in search for this one that we saw in an ad just last week but unfortunately guys we weren't able to get a hold of a salesperson in the short time of being here mainly because of the rush hour traffic that we were in but we did reschedule for another appointment to visit this dealership sometime later this week anyways guys wish me luck as i go in for my second night shift in a row tonight and so i'll just catch you guys again tomorrow so post shift i tried to surprise my co-worker josie surprise <laughs> with a ride home in the tesla rental <laughs> hey hello since for today do you know why because it's a rental <laughs> here do you know how to open this no okay look it's my first time. you go like this and then the handle comes out oh. wow oh. and ladies first <laughs> which would be her first ever experience riding a tesla See the awesome. word. What is that? This oh, one. Oh, oh. Ooh, oh, hands. Oh, hands. oh my gosh, Josie! Josie! Is this auto? This is auto. My oh. hands are on it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know. I you just I want to leave. And needless to say, I think she really enjoyed her experience. 
blast off. We're gonna blast off, okay? No! no. Yes. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. No! no. <laughs> but yeah, after saying bye bye to our rental this morning and delivering the car back to the rental agency. Bye, Tesla. Thank you for your service. I got a quick 100 minutes sleep before staying up all day afterwards just editing some live from last week videos on the laptop. And now this evening, feeling that the lack of sleep is finally affecting me, I'm just gonna wrap it up and head straight to bed to see how much sleep I can actually get tonight. So unfortunately guys, my watch ran out of battery last night. So I couldn't track my sleep, but I could tell you it was around five hours once again, as I was able to pass out just after midnight and take this quick screenshot when I woke up, as well as a video of me just before the sunrise. Anyways, recalling this scene from last week at ANW, but not before we mark down the date for the next Burgers for MS event on August 22nd. I was filling up the Baby Rouge at a local gas station this morning when coincidentally I saw this A&W at this location. So dressed up in my traditional A&W colors, I went in on this August 22nd Burgers to be MS Day and cut this promo for one of my childhood friends living with MS, Shelby. So today, August 22, I'm here early morning at the local A&W to get my teen burger as today is Burgers to be MS Day where $2 from every teen burger goes to help beat MS. This bite's for you, Shelby. And afterwards, going here for the first time since I quickly popped by while in the middle of the Sporting Life 10K race, I went to this Planet Fitness to not really work out, but to edit videos on the laptop while on the stationary bike, while finishing eating my teen burger that I had bought earlier. And while riding back home on the motorcycle to try to catch up on some rest, on the side of the street, this is who I ran into. Yo guys, guess who I ran into while riding the motorcycle this morning? What? <laughs> Yo, Pilas, I miss working with this car. Give me a hug. <laughs> and especially since it's been quite a while back since we last saw each other, I just want to say, Pilas, it was great catching up with you once again. But moving on, before we wrap it up for tonight, we just have a quick birthday shout out to one of my former co-workers out there. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Joey. Happy birthday, Joey. And we got a birthday greeting to one of the former nursing students who had their consolidation on the unit that I work on. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Bethel. Happy birthday, Bethel. I'm hoping that everybody that has their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. So starting off quickly, I have a birthday greeting to one of my family friends out there. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Nicole. Happy birthday, Ate Nicole. I'm hoping that everybody has their birthdays today, are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. But yeah, traveling back to the Saga house last night, I thought that I'd at least get some better sleep. But same old story as I only got about five hours of rest in. Waking up this morning, not only just to edit my videos, 
but to upload the latest live from last week episode on YouTube while hanging out with the cute little puppy Sesame over here who also watched over me as I finished up eating my a and burger that I had just yesterday. Anyways, recalling where we were just a couple days back, the wife and I headed to the exact same car dealership near the airport today to test drive this beauty of a Tesla. And guys, after we got ourselves buckled in, observing that the car sensors around the car were definitely working, we took a spin in this car, testing out its autopilot capabilities. Can it stop? Oh my god, baby. It goes pretty Ooh, look at that. <laughs> I think it's because I wasn't holding the wheel. Before returning it back home to its dealership. We then headed back to Scarborough to the Fu Metro slash Bonmi Metro to get some well delicious looking and tasting pho. And some amazing banh mi as well. Pretty good, it's good, it's delicious. So yeah guys, if you're ever in the Warden and Lawrence area of Scarborough, be sure to hit up this restaurant that I would definitely recommend to anyone. Next, after accompanying the wife to her physiotherapy session, we decided to head over to another local Hyundai dealership to check out a car that the wife has always wanted to try. Which guys was the Hyundai Kona N. And after having the wife test this baby out and almost getting caught by the police during our drive. Oh watch there's police. Yep. <laughs> Don't rip it yet. <laughs> oh. Oh. We just may or may not have found our winner for the car that we will take home someday. Anyways, back in the Queen Street West area of Toronto this evening, I'm just coming back from yet another super kicked wrestling event. A crazy one, if I might add. With this month's version being called Super Kicked e With another great time on Queen Street West watching the Super Kicked event last night, I had these highlights being some of my favorites.
up to today after going to bed late and waking up early after only less than four hours of sleep in order to drive the wife to work this morning. When I got back to the condo, I prepared a breakfast for the special guest of the night, Giselle and I to have before going to local car dealership to test drive something that might look a little bit familiar. And after G okayed the car with her mechanic skills here, we took this mini baby for a spin. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're in the mini. In the mini again. What errands are we doing today, Jay? <laughs> I know. <laughs> and with the exception of it being a different color, a lack of a navigation screen, no backup sensors. Oh, I don't know. I'm not hearing anything. I don't hear anything. As well as no driver's seat armrest. No armrest. Is that a deal breaker? <laughs> Is that a deal breaker? <laughs> this car was almost exactly the same as our first 2015 five door Mini Cooper. And after parting ways with G so she can go and take care of Grandma, I headed up north to the Improve Canada complex to check out a wrestling event that was taking place there. That featured wrestlers who were also wrestling in last night's Super Kicked event. As well as a few that I have met in person in the past. Yo, Gabriel Fuerza! <laughs> Meeting some new ones as well. Especially this guy who's the Cousin Lou's favorite wrestler. Come on, can I take a picture? No, one, two, three, psycho bike! <laughs> All being a part of a bigger event here. Hosted by this guy, DJ Starting From Scratch, who you guys know I met last month. Taking it all in with the cousin Faye and Edouave. As well as the nephew Vision. Attending this event called Way Back A Journey Through the 90s. So first of all, today we have a quick birthday shout out to one of my titas out there. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Mommy Po. Happy birthday, Mommy Po. We next got a birthday greeting to one of my manangs out there who I remember playing table tennis with back in our holidays in Jamaica. This birthday shout out goes out to you, Manang Raji. Happy birthday, Manang Raji. And last but not least, we got a birthday shout out to one of my indoor volleyball friends out there who I remember playing alongside with during our Cabbage Town days. This birthday shout out goes out to you Riggs. Happy birthday Riggs. I'm hoping that everybody that has their birthdays today are doing well, staying safe and healthy at this time, and had a great celebration for your birthdays this year. But yeah, after leaving you guys last night, 
looking at my Too Good To Go app, I went to the College Street area of downtown to pick up from Thakbuan our dinner and took it home to enjoy. But yeah, after passing out from lack of sleep last night, but my body automatically waking me up after I only got six hours of sleep, I woke up to do more research on some more potential cars on the laptop to be productive until it was time to go to the St. Teresa Parish Shrine of the Little Flower for Sunday morning Catholic Mass. Then in the afternoon, just like we did a couple weeks ago, we headed to the Queensway Badminton Club to play some pickup badminton with the wife, Dwi Hang and Giselle. So after another fun session of playing badminton with these guys, we got invited to their house in Saga with this pretty amazing home theater system to enjoy not just some home cooking, but some pretty tasty backyard barbecue here. Cheersing not only to good times and great hangouts, but also to the amazingly delicious food that we had yesterday evening. Anyways, afterwards, headed back to the Saga house last night, we had this little escapade with this quick, agile spider in the bedroom, trying to figure out a way to let it out without killing or harming it. Move it. Oh shit! Where did it go? There it is. Ah. You got it. <laughs> Need a piece of paper. Killers? No. Unfortunately, Tita, I'm I don't have a killer instinct. Ah, that's good. So. Yeah, that's why she's always like. And then ah. <laughs> he releases it. <laughs> I need a piece of paper. Okay. Get it? Oh, good job. Where did it go? Okay. No, it's there. It's there. <laughs> <laughs> Where is it? Hold on. It's there. Where? Over there. Okay. Yeah, ready? <laughs> Please, Peter. It's, it's not in my arm right now. <laughs> is it, is it gone? <laughs> <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> you owe me a Hyundai Kona. <laughs> oh, just a Kona? Wait, what the heck is that? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, on to today where we had a busy, productive day already. Waking up early after a minimal six hour sleep. The wife and I borrowed a vehicle to make a one and a half hour trek to and a two hour trek back to the city. Visiting the great place of Cayuga on this random road trip before we both go in for a night shift tonight. Making our way to this far off dealership to look at another car that eerily might look a little bit familiar. So taking a nice test drive in this 2015 Mini Cooper S model earlier today.
then having the wife take it on a spin herself? Dalgit 2.0! Dalgit Dalgit! Dalgit Dalgit! We decided to say goodbye to this car for the time being! With you guys having to tune into next week's episode to find out if we bought this car or not. And so, with that guys, we'll wrap up this week's Live From Last Week episode right here. So, if you guys have enjoyed what you've been watching, feel free to follow Chino Walker POV on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Be sure to like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notifications bell to be notified when new videos from Jay Walker POV come out. And once again, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Stay safe and healthy out there. And we'll see you next time on Live From Basketball.